video is about using the formula for simple interest to find um, it, it, not just if you want to find the interest, if you want to find the rate or the time or the principal and you have the other pieces of information. And it's really just like um, manipulating a formula and if, or an equation and a formula or equation. So if you think about this, this is the interest rate, this is the, the interest amount, this is the principal, the interest rate, the time. So if I know three of those pieces of information and want to find the, the fourth piece, then um, if, if I know the interest amount earned and I'm trying to find the time, I would multiply P times R, the principal times the rate, and then divide, oops, divide this by PR. And whatever I do to one side of the equation, I do to the other. So I would multiply these together, then divide, and divide both sides. And that would leave me with T, finding out the time. So let me show you an example of what this looks like. So the interest earned is equal to the principal times the rate as a decimal times the time. Um, if the interest earned is $400, interest earned, interest earned $400, the principal is $2,000, and the interest rate is 5%. How long was the principal earning interest? So I'm going to use a calculator. Um, some of these get very um, intricate into, in their um, calculations, but I'm going to plug it first into my equation, I equals PRT. The interest earned is $400. The principal is 2000 and remember, principal is what we start out with. The rate is 5%. 5%, I need it as a decimal. So decimal percent, 0 0.05. So that's 0 0.05 here times the time. And that's my variable. That's what it's asking for, how long was it earning interest, the T for time. So now I have an answer equals a multiplication times a multiplication. So I'm going to calculate this first, 2,000 times 0 .05 equals 100. And that's T, T still there and 400 is still there. All I've done is I have multiplied 2,000 times point, the rate, 0 .05. So now we can do the math, and it's really easy. So this is a multiplication equation. How do I undo a multiplication equation? I divide, I'm gonna divide by 100 so that it gets rid of this 100 and I can get T by itself. Whatever I do to one side of the equation, I do to the other side of the equation. So 400 divided by 100 is 4. 4 equals T. So what is that saying? That's saying that the time is 4 years. The time is 4 years. Um, how long? 4 years. And T is um, always in years. If you're given months, you need to make sure that um, T is converted to years. So this is not four months, this is four years. So the answer, four years. Okay, so stop the video now and work the problem um, that you have to make sure that you understand how to manipulate this formula to find a missing term.